Hello guys, welcome back to Tech Projects. I am back with another video. So in this video, I am going to show you how to create auto resize edit text in Android Studio. So recently I am working on a project. So I come across this problem. So I figure out this problem, how to solve this problem. So you can use this thing in any kind of project. So let's see a demo what we are going to make. So I open this application. So you can see it contain a edit text and by default I set the maximum size and minimum text size. So you can set any text size. Let us suppose if I type here you can see. Now let us suppose if I typing words inside this. So now you can see the size is same. But when the text number or we can say words count increases it automatically decreases its size so you can see the text size is now decreased successfully and now let us suppose if i type in more words then it will automatic automatically going to decrease so you can see now the word so you can see the now font size is automatically get decreased and let's type in one more words and my keyboard contain emoji more than words i don't know why so now if I type more and more words so you can see it is automatically going to decrease and it is very amazing thing so you can implement this kind of application in any kind of project so you may need this kind of thing in any kind of application so we are going to see how to create this thing in Android so don't further delay now let's start the video and see how to do this and one more thing if you don't subscribe our channel then please subscribe the channel and hit the bell notification and also you can follow my Instagram page for regular coding content daily so now let's start the video so first of all what we have to do we have to open our endo studio so i open my endo studio and i already created this project auto resize edit text so you can see this is our project name so you can give any name to your project and you don't need to add any dependency recently android in 2017 android add a support to auto resize text font size but for text view not for edit text so auto resize for text view is available but not for edit text so so in this video i will show you how to do this with edit text so for this i have to take a open bracket first of all i i am going to use the auto resize which is in built provided by the endo studio so first of all i am going to take a text view here so i simply take a text view here set the layout with mass parent and in the case of if you want to make it auto resize then you have to give the fix height otherwise it will not going to work so you have to give fix height otherwise it is if you try to set it match parent or wrap content then it is it will not going to work so hope you understand now inside this you can set any text size now you can set any text size it is your choice so i simply type here 20 sp now the main thing start from here so i simply set auto maximum text size so this is the maximum text size which you want on your edit text so i simply type here 40 sp and then you have to type here minimum text size and minimum text size whatever you want so i simply type here 10 sp i want minimum this and then i have to type here auto size step granularity so it means how in it it means how much change you want in your edit text like uh, from 40 sp to 38 sp then 36 like this one so i simply set it to 2 sp and then after this you can set any by default text on your text view but we are not going to use this because we, our main focus is how to work with edit text not text view and simply set it gravity and you can give set gravity center i set the gravity center and then i simply give the padding 20 dp it is fine and then i have to give id so i simply give the id here text view <coughs> then i simply type here auto screen size auto size text type and inside this you have to pass here uniform and then close this so you can see our text view is created successfully now i have to create a edit text above this text view because I want to implement that feature in my edit text not on text view so I have to implement so simply take a edit text here simply give the layout width and height same as your text view so I simply type this then after this you have to give any id so I simply give the id here edit text you can give any id and then I simply give the hint and uh, something and then after this set the gravity so I set the gravity center and then I simply set type padding 20 dp and by default what I want on my text size on my edit text I simply give it 40 sp it is fine now close this <clears throat> so you can see edit text present on the now I have to set the visibility of this text to you gone or invisible not gone invisible so it is fine now you can see the our text to you is not visible and only edit text is visible so I am going to take the reference of this text to you and then I will set the size on my edit text according to this text view so this thing is very amazing so let's see how to implement this 
so open your main activity so this is kt file so you can implement this in both java or kt it is your choice i simply take a private late init var and edit text and private late init var text view so it is fine so let's assign the xml id to java id edit text equal find view id r dot id dot and edit text this one and then text view equal find view id r dot id dot text view it is fine now what we have to do we have to use a uh, edit text on add text chain listener because i want to decrease the font size of my edit text so i simply type here edit text dot add text chain listener inside this we have to create object in java if you type new then it will automatically going to show suggestion but in kotlin we have to type here object and then we have to type here text watcher and then take two curly braces now after this we have to take cursor here and implement its member so we have to implement all three members it is fine now we can remove this to do statements otherwise it will going to show error so delete this delete this and also delete this now we have to write the code inside our on text chain whenever the text is changed i have to decrease the font size according to the text text length so for this what i have to do first of all i have to set this text on my text view first of all i have to set that that text which is present on my edit text i have to set that text on my text view so i simply type here text view dot set text and inside this i can pass here as two string because this text is present inside this string so this in care sequence and as two string i convert this into string now after this i have to take a variable of size which will hold the text size from the text view and then i am going to set that text size on my edit text so i simply type here where size and i can type here text view dot text size and in if you are working with java then you have to use a get text size now after this we have to divide this size by 3 so it will returning size 3 times so i have to type here size equal size by 3 now after this we have to set this text font size on my edit text so edit text dot text size and equal i have to set the size so that's it now you can see it is fine now if i run this application then it will going to work so let's check our application whether the application is working fine or not i press on run button and gradle start building now gradle is built successful and it will going to install application inside our phone and application install successfully so it is launching so you can see now let us suppose if i type here my name i start from my name Vijesh Kumar Sharma. you can easily find the attached file is scan so you can see now the font size of my text view is decreasing and i fetching that font size and i am setting that font size on my edit text so hope you understand how this logic is working so this is very amazing logic and if you try to find out this kind of thing then you will not going to find out this kind of thing and you have to write lots of code like you have to count the word characters and every time you have to count word characters if the word character limit is this then you have to set the font size this and this but this is very amazing thing and this is very clean code so i hope guys you like this video if you have any question you can comment down below i will try to give the answer of every comment please like the video please like the video i don't need anything i simply need your like so please like the video please subscribe the channel and please share the video so if you have any question you can comment down below i will try to give the answer of every comment thank you see you soon in next amazing project